hey everyone welcome back to my channel so for today's video we're gonna go ahead and jump right into it and we're gonna start off by using the morphe times jacqueline hill palette i'm gonna go ahead and grab this color and just blend it into my crease So now that I have my transition color nice and blend, I'm going to go ahead and jump into the shade Rockstar and it's such a pretty purple color and it's matte too. And these colors in this palette are so pretty guys, like I'm dying for the colors. Honestly, I think this palette is a must and everyone should have it. The colors are honestly, guys, I, I can't stop talking about the colors because they're so amazing. You get your mattes, you get your shimmers. Like, what more do you want in a palette? So now I'm going to go ahead and dip my brush into the Sparks color. And this color is a very burgundy shade. You gotta work into it though to get the color you want, but other than that, it's so pretty. So I'm going to go ahead and use my concealer to create kind of like an arc, I guess. Kind of like if you're cutting a crease but not blending your concealer all the way. And then on top of that, I'm going to use one of the eyeshadows. So I'm using this pink champagne type of color and I'm placing it on top of the arc I made. It's called Glitz and Glam. So I'm going to go ahead and create just a small wing with my Wet n Wild Mega Liner. Honestly, I miss the NYC liner because that one was the best drugstore liner ever. But oh well, this one works, you know. So I did prep my face before I started putting on my Fenty Beauty foundation. And I used a little bit of the Fix Plus. And then on top of that, I added on my pores where you can see all my little pores, you know, just popping out I put some of the Maybelline Master Primer I believe so then I'm gonna go ahead and conceal my face and I'm gonna use my no filter concealer from Colourpop and I'm going to go ahead and give this concealer maybe 3 stars out of 5 stars because I really like the texture of it but it does crease on me and that's just a no-go for me. So I'm just going back with my Real Techniques sponge and I'm blending everything together. Now to set my face, I'm going to go ahead and use my Airspun Setting Powder 
and honestly I really do like this powder but I'm thinking of going back to my Laura Mercier because that one was the best one now I'm just going back to finish the last touches for my eyes and under my eyes I'm using the shade Sparks it's a burgundy that I used on my lid I'm just throwing it on the bottom of my waterline to contour my face I'm using the elf cosmetics prime and stay finishing powder I got it in the shade medium to dark and I really like the color it gives my face like it complements my skin tone it's a very nice bronze matte color I recommend this product because it's so cheap and it works very really well I think I got it at Target for like five dollars or six something like that I mean it's pretty cheap either way So now I'm just going to use my Maybelline Super Stay Full Coverage Powder Foundation. Jeez, that was long. Anyways, I'm using it in the shade Honey Caramel. And I'm just putting it all over my face just because sometimes I feel like I look too white. I'm barely trying out this product and I kind of like it. And to finish up the eyes, I'm just adding that Glitz and Glam eyeshadow to the corner of my eyes. I didn't record when I was putting on my lashes, but I used the Soy Cosmetics, I'm sorry, Soy Sweet Cosmetics Synthetic Lashes, and I got it in the shade No Filter. So now to make myself glow, I'm going to go ahead and use the Huda Beauty 3D Highlighter Palette. This palette is actually awesome. Like, damn. I fucking glow. And to finish up this look, I'm using my MAC Cosmetics Lipstick in Spirit. It's a nice nude, like brown nude. It's really pretty. But yes, guys, this is the end of the video. I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Let me know what you guys want to see next. And I'll see you guys on my next video.